I was a mess coming into it. And I was just like, you know, I don't really, I don't really want to even see men right now. <laughs> I watched that season as well with you and Tom. And I thought for sure it was the right, the real deal. Um, so sorry that didn't work out. I know that you opened up about it a little bit on Watch What Happens Live. You said that you haven't heard from him and that he did cheat. Can you elaborate a little bit about that? How did you find out what happened? Um, yeah, we were, you know, working on different boats. It was when the pandemic had just happened. So it was impossible for us to see each other. It was right when the show was coming out. So obviously a lot going on in our lives. Um, and yeah, he found someone else on his boat and I didn't know for a couple months. I found out through a friend and all hell broke loose. <laughs> He's very sorry. He's apologetic. He wants to get back with me, but wow. not, not for me. You, you wouldn't consider it? No. When's the last time you spoke? Um, I think when we were filming that, yeah, when he was calling. And, you know, that's right at the end after months of like fighting and just being like, you cheated on me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, no, there's other fish in the sea. Yeah, unfortunately, this industry, it's tough. You're always in these like long distance relationships. You're on different continents, time zones, but you know. If what working. What is kind of your overall outlook on boatmances now? Well, the thing is, is in this industry, like it's hard to not have them. Like, yeah. you know, these are the people we work around. It's just kind of like, you know, every other industry, the people you work around are the ones you build these close relationships with. And for us, these may be the only people we meet for months at a time. So you naturally develop feelings towards people. So I think there can be healthy ones. Um, I haven't given up on them, but yeah, yeah. I don't really want to jump into another long distance one. Do you regret anything about your relationship with Tom? Uh, no, like you learn, you yeah. live and you learn. I, I, I think in hindsight, I probably would not have loved for him to come on the show. I don't, I was never, I was never really dying to work with him on the show. I kind of wish we would have kept those two things separate. Yeah. Uh, I think that would have helped our relationship a lot. David hinted at some feelings towards you. Were you aware of this in the, in the moment? Not like, really, not at first. I didn't think so. And then I think it was after the, I think when he got the bravery from alcohol, I was like, oh, <laughs> I'm quite impressed with how strong you're coming on right now. <laughs> yeah. Um, Lloyd as well hinted at some feelings for you, a little crushing. Were you aware of that at the time as well? No. And I actually was never aware of that until I watched it back, kind of. I was like, oh, Lloyd had feelings for me. <laughs> Did you reciprocate with either of them? Any any feelings back? Um, not yet, no. Not yet. Okay. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> with with your past relationships on the boat, specifically with Tom too, were you hesitant to jump into a boatmance again? Yeah, a hundred percent. I think I even told David that I like, you know, everything with Tom and I was falling apart right before we filmed this season. So um I was a mess coming into it. And I was just like, you know, I don't really, I don't really want to even see men right now. <laughs> so I think unfortunately for my admirers, I was not in a place to uh, look for romance.